Hey everybody, um, this video is going to be about how to analyze a song. Um, and it's a different piece um, of art and literature, so it's kind of tricky. So I'm going to go ahead and walk you through this so you guys know exactly what to do when it's your turn. Um, so this example, first you would click on the link, which I already have done. Um, and you're going to go, that's going to go ahead and open you up in the YouTube, and that's where you, you'll listen to it um, before you start filling out this form here. Um, so first thing you're going to do is name. So who wrote the song? Um, so looking here, Ernest Stoneman wrote this song called All I Got's Gone. Um, so for name, I would write Ernest Stoneman as name. Uh, so that's who is singing the song. Um, that's who it's by. The next is feeling. Um, so after listening to this song, um, you guys are more than welcome to listen to it. It's a little bit long, so I'll go ahead and fill this out. But if you have free time, please go listen to a song. It's a great song. Um, the feeling I get from this song from the 1930s uh, is very sad. So I'd write the feeling from this song is very sad. Um, it, it could be happy or sad, uh, kind of state which one you're, you're feeling when you listen to the song. And then to support it, you're going to need the lyrics, some of the lyrics. So the first one I'm going to start out with is the name of the song, All I Got Gone. That just goes to show that it's very sad. Everything that Ernest had uh, and people during the 1930s had was gone. Um, another big one uh is going to be one of the other lyrics and also if you have trouble listening feel free to look up the lyrics i did for this song um so all i got's gone song lyrics um so use the two as during the assignment you have two so if you need to look up the lyrics uh, you're more than welcome to it helps me and it'll probably help you um so one that pops out is uh people bought automobiles didn't know how that's gonna feel uh rode around so grand and proud Notes come due, couldn't pay it out, all they got's gone, all they got's gone. So then I'd go back and put that lyric, the one that stood out most to me, which would be notes come due, couldn't pay it out. So I'll write notes come due, comma, couldn't pay it out. So that was one of the lyrics that stood out to me and that kind of reflects the feeling that you get from the song. Um, and that's what I would write for that. We'll go ahead and add another, add two or three here. Um, all they got's gone, all they got's gone. That one's just as important as all I got's gone. Um, just goes to show that it wasn't just some people, it was most people. All they got's gone, um, comma, all they got's gone. And then one more lyric, so try to do three, four if you can, that'll, it's kind of supporting evidence of why you get this feeling. Um, country dudes are riding cars, tailor-made suits, smoking scars, run to the barbershop, primping and rubbing. Uh, but you're right now, they're plowing in a grubbing for all they got's gone, all they got's gone. That's just as important. So use your judgment here. Um, passion their dresses or their husband's old britches. This one's very important, um, I believe. So I'm going to go ahead and use this one. Uh, I feel like that really pushes towards the feeling of the sadness that you get from the song. Uh, women are patching their dresses, their husbands old britches. They don't have money to buy new clothes. That's the sad part about this song about the Great Depression. Um, next is going to be beat and rhythm. Uh, this is kind of like what the song is like. So this song by Ernest Stoneman is very much a swing music type of song. Uh, I can tell this by the upbeat and fast pace, as well as instruments used, such as the trumpet and uh, harmonica. Uh, these, so the beat rhythm section is where you're gonna wanna write why you get, you're going to first decide whether it's like swing, jazz, blues, bluegrass, um, based on what you know, 
and then you're gonna explain why. So the why is the big important part here. I wrote it's upbeat, fast paced, and some of the instruments like the harmonica, a little bit of trumpet is what really puts this together as swing music. So make sure you understand when you put swing or blues or jazz or whatever it may be that you explain the why aspect of it as well. The next and main central, the main slash central message is gonna be kind of all this information you've gathered so far up. Um, so, so far it's by Ernest Snowman. The feeling I get is very sad. Here's some of the lyrics explaining why it's sad. The beat and rhythm is upbeat, but it's still very sad. So the main and central message that's gonna come from this is that people were suffering from the Great Depression and all that they owned and loved were gone within a short period of time. So that's the main and central message I'm getting from the song. Uh, it'll be different for different music and different eras, obviously, so make sure to pay attention to that. Using the clues and breaking down of the song, that's how you're gonna get your main and central message. Um, and then the last question, uh, for analyzing a song is, what does this song reveal about the 30s? Um, if this song's from the 20s, it'll say 20s, but this one's from the 30s. So I'm gonna write, this song reveals the true sadness and depression that came from the 1930s, such as, using the evidence I have, the loss of vehicles, food, and pretty much everything that they owned. So this song reveals about the 30s, uh, excuse me, I spelled that wrong, the true sadness and depression that came from the 30s, such as losing of personal items, um, kind of the stuff that makes you feel normal. So the loss of that was very huge. It just reveals about the 1930s was a time of, of poverty, not a lot of people had money, sadness. People were living in tents compared to mansions and having these nice cars that they used to in the 1920s. Um, so this put together between the what does the song reveal, main central message, beat rhythm, and lyrics, as well as feeling in the who wrote it, should be all that you need for analyzing the song. It should help you break down the song understand what the main and central message was, how you got there with the lyrics, what your the feeling that you get from it, happy or sad, and why, and what type of music. So swing, blues, jazz, bluegrass, any of that. So please refer back to this if you need it. Um, this example will be, this hard copy will be in the assignment. You can refer back, but if you need the video, please watch this again to help you see how I got to these conclusions. Again, feel free to look up the lyrics of these songs if it's too fast paced or hard to hear, that helps me a lot and I'm pretty sure it would help a lot of you guys out as well. Um, so thank you.